Breaking news tonight in an axe attack in West Hollywood. Detectives said they just caught their man. CBS 2's Tom Wade is live in West Hollywood with this bizarre and disturbing story. Tom? Yeah, absolutely, Rick. That attack happened on Saturday morning just behind me at this 7-Eleven. And as you said, in just the past hour, an arrest was made in this case just about a block from where I am at Fairfax in Santa Monica. Also new tonight, the neighborhood watch in this area is saying they've had at least two violent run-ins with this homeless guy in the last two months. The front of this 7-Eleven turns into a horror show. As one man leaves the store, another one follows and attacks. First a punch, and then he goes on a rampage with an axe, whacking the guy on the ground over and over, even dropping his weapon and picking it up. When it looks like he's done, he comes back for more. Finally, he leaves the scene. This is crazy. Jay Ned lives in the neighborhood and comes to this 7-Eleven often near the corner of Santa Monica and Fairfax. It's really safe. There's a, a lot of police patrolling all the time and I, I don't see it happening in West Hollywood. Why this crazy attack unfolded is also dumbfounding. Sheriff's investigators say the victim saw his attacker shoplifting inside the 7-Eleven and offered to pay for his items. For some reason, that enraged the man and he launched his assault. This is not a very common crime. I mean, we had a, a, a decent citizen trying to pay for a homeless transient's uh, items that he was stealing. This is a close-up of the guy, according to sheriff's investigators. He was caught tonight in the area of Fairfax in Santa Monica. It's not clear how they tracked him down. I know that there's some problems with homeless people coming in and out, and there's people at the other 7-Eleven down the street, but this is, this is crazy. As for the victim, he is still in the hospital recovering from his injuries.